Welcome back to the channel guys, my name is Ardil and today is all about the INEOS Grenadier and in specific adding in some custom lighting. So firstly what did the vehicle actually come in with? It came in with a roof rack that actually sat here and across here and what that actually meant was that it restricted the actual canopy from opening up at the top, the little window that you got at the top, stopped it opening because the light bar originally was there. The client wanted additional lighting and all that could be offered was that as a solution. However, there was a couple of issues with it. Firstly, obviously it was blocking the roof part from opening. Secondly, was the amount of wind noise that our client was getting from that light bar because it was quite a beefy light bar that was sat up at the top on top of the roof rack and it just created a hell of a lot of noise for our client. So we wanted to change a couple of things on the vehicle. So what we've gone for is an elite 48 light bar and this is our fully custom solution. These, Both these solutions have never been done before. So you've seen it here first guys. The install that we've done is on the 48 Elite Bar, absolutely stunning. And the reason why we selected this, and I've had this myself on multiple cars myself, they, they are absolutely phenomenal in terms of that light kind of pattern that is, it displays further forward. Amount of light output from this is absolutely exceptional and far, far better than some of those bigger light bars that you can see or like what was on here originally. What we've done is actually built custom bracketry here. This is all built out of ABS. We've got steel rods that run all the way through, so it's nice and solid on here. But moving it from up here to down here with the slimline light bar, with our custom design as well for the brackets, what this is gonna mean is you're gonna have far, far less wind noise, as well as the fact you've actually got a better light bar system as well. So that is the light bar, it looks absolutely phenomenal, really, really neat and tidy, and it just makes the car look a lot cooler and nicer as well. We're having that there. Next thing on is the front grille area. So what you'll actually notice, well, maybe you can't really notice because this looks very stock. Laser lamps do two options now. So, well, one option from laser lamps. So they actually do like an integration kit. And that normally uses a triple R light that sits long ways along here. So. As you guys know, if you own one of these vehicles, this grill here houses two circular lights. However, when you do the linear, um, the laser lamp integration solution, it goes to that triple R, which is kind of a, a slim line light, and it sits in between these two brackets here. They look really, really smart. However, from factory, from the Ineos, they come with a round design here, and we, then you're taking that and taking it to a kind of rectangular design. Our client wanted to keep the original aesthetics of the vehicle. However, I wanted a little bit more light from those high beams. So what we've actually done is mounted in the Sentinel lights. And this is honestly no easy task to get these in, but look how incredible they stand. So you can't actually see the laser lamp logo there, but these are laser lamp Sentinel lights. They look absolutely bonkers here and they work so nicely. So the way the system actually works is all via the CAN bus system on the car. So we've freshly wired it in from our workshop facilities here in Cambridge. The way the system works, you've got a little switch up at the top on that central control panel, which is really, really cool. Um, what actually it does and the way it works is when that switch is on, when you do your high beam, you'll get these main high beam lights, you'll get these as well as the roof bar light as well, all coming on at once when that switch at the top is on. When that switch is off, it goes back to just a traditional high beam system and these will no longer operate. So really easy to use and literally just straight onto your high beam and you can have all the light you could possibly want or you can just go back to your factory ones whenever that switch is off. So really easy to control, nothing kind of buttons or anything around anywhere in the places into that factory button up at the top seamless integration into the Ineos Grenadier and they just look absolutely incredible. I mean, this looks really, really smart up at the top, but these I'm really, really happy with. They suit the car to a T because it keeps that original design and original look. So if you're interested in having this solution added onto your vehicle, whether you want to do individuals or you want to do it all out like we've done on this car or we want additional lighting across the rest of the vehicles, kind of flood lighting, we can do it all. So best thing to do is reach out to us. We've got some options from laser lamps on our website. And if you're interested in the Ineos Grenadier system, where it's like an integration kit as a pre-made solution rather than this custom work, feel free to reach out to us as well. But thank you so much for watching today's video. I really hope you've enjoyed it and also looking forward to upgrading your vehicle. Next, I'll see you in the next one.